Good morning, everyone. Today we're taking a bus tour to Brooklyn and around Brooklyn, and uh, we're walking around Brooklyn. It's a Brooklyn day. Uh, we're at Nathan's Hot Dogs. My microphone broke on my actual camera, so I'm filming this with my iPhone. Fun stuff. Nathan's Hot Dogs were great. Uh, it's a cool area. You can see all of this kind of stuff. Man, I wish I could have my actual camera, my actual microphone, but I'll tell you about that later. How, what do you think the large the line is getting? <laughs> East Coast water, huh? Right? <laughs> oh wow, lighting. Alright, that works. Hi everyone, welcome back to the show. We've been touring Brooklyn for about three or four or five hours. I don't know. It's been a fun time. Hi Joey. My audio right now is terrible and I apologize. My microphone uh, broke today, so I'm gonna fix it later. All I need is a tiny screwdriver and I'll be able to fix it. So until then, sorry for the audio. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know where we are right now, but it's a cool place, I think. Uh, it's a cool view of the bridge, if you can see that. <laughs> cool view of Molly. <laughs> and uh, also, it's cold out today, which is a good thing to know. Yeah, cool, all right, that's all you need to know for now. See you in a bit. <laughs> of that was picked up. This is the third time filming it. Today's been rough. Rough with my camera, not with anything else. Essentially, all I need to say is that my camera, like the mount broke, and so all I needed to do was screw back in this tiny screw. It's a very, very tiny screw. So to fix it, all I did was use this paper clip. Oh. So to fix it, all I did was use this paper clip and um, just screwed back in, so it's all good. Yeah. Anyways, um, so I fixed that. Fun time. Um, also, it's like 12.30, so I'm trying to be quiet. 12.30 or 1, something like that. But yeah, so I use this paper clip to fix my microphone. I'm very proud about that. I think this is an area where I don't have to be as quiet. But essentially, everyone, I'm glad I fixed it. I feel like I should talk about today. But yeah, it's been a good day. We did a lot of walking and a lot of like just sightseeing and like a lot of that kind of stuff. And then later for dinner, we met up with two cinematographers. Well, three if you count the alumni who was there. So we met up with these three directors of photography, these three cinematographers. And we kind of just had this huge talk about the industry and about everything in it and just basically asking them any questions questions we have and hearing stories from them. So I had a lot of fun with that. It was a very fun time. It was a good dinner. And overall, my biggest takeaways from this was just like how action and opportunity both kind of like work together. I personally believe that luck is when opportunity meets preparedness. And I believe that action helps prepare you for things. So when that opportunity comes and you are prepared because you've been taking action, then that's when people have like their big break or their luck. That kind of stuff. So, when you think about it that way, luck is all dependent on one opportunities and two the amount of work you put in. So, 
If I can encourage you in any way, I would encourage you to take action as often as you can, make as many things as you can, and just do. If you're a filmmaker, if you were an artist, if you're anything, like, it, you don't even have to be film. As long as you're doing things and working harder towards your goals, boom, you're perfect, you're fine. So, those are my big takeaways from today. I've really enjoyed getting to walk around Brooklyn and Queens and all that kind of stuff. I mean, we didn't walk around Queens today, but getting to walk around Brooklyn was really cool. It's a very awesome area, and, uh, the history of New York is a very cool thing to know. So if you're ever thinking about moving to New York, I would encourage you to maybe like take a couple days to come visit. If you can't do that, I don't know exactly know what advice I have for you because I haven't done it yet. It's hard for me to say this because you know I don't know how long I'm gonna live and I don't know how much longer I'll be on this earth. I could die tomorrow, I could die 80 years from now. That'd be crazy, I'd be 100. But ultimately, if, you know, it's in God's plan for me, I'd love to move to New York after college. I'm gonna work towards moving out here after college. I think I'd, it'd be really cool to live with MJ, um, my best friend MJ. I don't know, there's a lot of cool things about living in New York that I think would be awesome. There's a lot of things that might be tough, but I really, uh, I think since I'm so young, I think I would be able to handle it. You know, they say if you can make it in New York, you can make it anywhere. And I kind of want to prove that I can make it anywhere, so. These are just my thoughts. I know I've been talking for a while, but ultimately I just want to put this on here so that one day, if slash when, I do move to New York and make it happen, I'd just love to be able to say, hey, look at this video of when I actually did it. So, that is that. So, thank you all for watching. Hope you've enjoyed this episode. We'll be back with regular scheduled content tomorrow. And as always, be awesome.